Hello, 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 everybody. Today we are playing Black Ops 4 Blood of the Dead, and we're doing a shotguns only challenge. Now, you might be thinking to yourself, Apothos, that's a strife, not a shotgun. You can start with a shotgun in this game. Well, the answer to that question is. I'm not a high enough level. I can't <laughs> equip the Mach 12. You have to be level 50. I'm level 42. Also, I just noticed you can see on the side all the Apothos connected. I keep messing up my intro on this. It's really embarrassing that I can't get my words out. Um, but that's why you see like eight Apothos connected on the side there. Uh, but yeah, we're going to be using this drive early on uh, just until we can get the Mach 12 that's outside. Uh, well, it'll be just fine. It'll be just fine. You might think, yo, you know, what about the custom mutations? As far as I'm aware in the custom games, you can't. Uh, uh, do Easter eggs and stuff. And we're gonna be doing Easter eggs. We're gonna be doing. We're gonna be doing some crazy stuff this summer. And I say crazy. I think it's. It'll be pretty fun. Um, so it, uh, that's the plan here. But round two is gonna be a big round. Unfortunately, we can't do a ton on round one. Uh, the reason for that being that we have uh, to buy the Mach 12, basically. If we were able to start with it, we would actually be able to get, like, both powers on round one, which would be really cool. But, no dice. Mach 12 costs a 1,000, so it's minus 1k points right off rip. Um, but I will be allowing us to knife during this challenge. I think knifing is gonna be gonna be fine, and hey, we just so happen to have a weapon that has a pretty good knife on it, but we won't be using that yet. In fact, I plan to only use it at a single part, uh, which is coming up not before too, too long, just because the Mach 12 without any attachments or anything is a little brutal to use. I'm not gonna lie. This gun kinda dookie if you don't have the like Giga Extended Mag, the Dragon's Breath on it and everything, which again, if we were a custom game, no problem, but my apologies for not grinding Black Ops for a little bit more. I do love this game. It's surely one of my favorite games uh, and it's a proper challenge as well at times. It, it's just a ton of fun all around in my opinion. Um, I think in this game, actually, is it? The melees and headshots give the same amount of points? They might. It's also like, we can actually use shotguns without completely screwing ourselves over. I wasn't supposed to end the round, but it's okay. It doesn't matter that much. I could have, yeah, I could have done it all on round two. But look, I guess it's going to be round three. It just makes it a little bit more difficult. I mean, just a little bit more fun, right? By the way, guys, if you're excited for the challenge, if you could, like, comment, subscribe. It does help out the channel a ton. It really does. But let's go ahead and we'll thin out the herds. And then we've got to make our way to the main prison through the cat walk which is a uh, rather dangerous if you've ever played this map but yeah it really like I love Black Ops 4 for a lot of reasons but I think what they did with Quick Revive uh, being built in I know you can see I have Quick Revive as my brew slot but uh, Quick Revive I think sh is pretty good to be built into solo you know it's just it, you, it's the same amount of downs or everything in fact it says I have two downs so it's actually might be one less I'm not sure if you're able to increase that number at all uh, but I think the weapon armory system is really fun. I do love the point system because it, it lets you use shotguns and snipers early on without completely destroying your economy and everything. Uh, but then also... Well, what's the last thing? Uh, but yeah, Jug's built in. Jug's just a mandatory perk in the normal game. Also, this is where we're using our knife here. Just so I can knife the zombies in front of me, because the Mog just does not really have enough ammo to deal with it. Um, we could use our specialist weapon, but I'm just going to be choosing to use this drive knife. It shouldn't be a big problem at all. We just got to make our way slowly but surely through here. Um, and you can, like I said, use your specialist weapon. It'll make it a breeze getting through this early part. Try not to worry about the ones slapping you from the side too much. They don't deal full damage. It seems really scary, but it's actually not too bad. We're going to swap back to the Mog 12 now. I don't want to use the Strive 2 too much. Um, it does. It feels a little cheaty, but I don't feel like it's that bad. All things like, look, we could be. I like, guess the same as using the specialist, right? Like, <laughs> I could just be using the specialist and tearing through all of them right now, but I'm not. <laughs> I think it's fine. I don't think it's a big deal. Man, there is a lot of zombies that spawn here. If you can do it on round one, it's like the best thing you can do, but. I'm just not able to unfortunately right now um but yeah so like the game is really hard because it's really easy in a way right does that make any sense the game gives you some very overpowered stuff being the uh the equipment like my sword and my these things i'll just toss one here just for the fun of it uh the, the, the wraith fires that's what they're called it gives you some very very op tools at the beginning but it is balanced out by the fact that the zombie ai in this game is actually just much more challenging now, I really do want to actually start getting these dogs fed, because we're going to need the Hills Retriever, that way we can get a free Blundergat. Now, I will say, we're going to be keeping the Blundergat as the Blundergat and upgrading it as such. The reason for that, the reason I'm doing that, is because it's the closest to what I view as an actual shotgun. It's still pellet-based, um, it doesn't shoot out acid or magma, so we're just going to be using the base Blundergat, which I think will be a ton of fun. I'm really, I'm, I'm excited, I think it'll be, I think it'll be a good time. 
I will be allowing equipment and everything, by the way, just because, you know, we do have potential run into ammo issues, like, here soon. Uh, and I, I, that's why I think it's not a big, big deal. I also don't know where all the wall buys are. If I knew where the wall buys were, I would definitely buy more. Can the dog eat dogs? <laughs> do we do we know if this dog here is a cannibal? Will he eat the uh, the hellhounds? Ooh, that hellhound did not die in a single bullet. That's actually a little bit surprising. I guess I can take this time to roam around a little bit and see if I can find a shotgun wall buy. I actually have no clue where they are. Um, how do we get to the other part of the map as well? Ooh, nice. We need that for the shield. Uh, we need to get power on. There's so much we need to do right now. Let's go down here. I think we'll worry about getting to the other part of the map here in a bit. Let's just keep going through base mob of the dead. I want to be able to get the shield made pretty early. We need to be... Ooh, shotgun. Uh, yes. Thank you. All right, so no more strife. No more strife shenanigans. We had our fun. Now we're on to, to big boy shotguns. This will probably be our main gun for a while. The mog, the mog's just not going to be cutting it. Uh, you, do I want to open this door? Is there anything else I need to do up here? No, I think we can keep opening the door. And there should be a shield piece somewhere down here. It has three spawns. One of them is in the citadel, which is what I'm pretty sure this is. Hold up, is that it? No. The game does get rather dark at times, and this haze doesn't help. The haze in the little citadel, citadel tunnels makes it a little bit hard to see. I don't have the warden's key yet. The warden would drop that as soon as we get the power on, but not yet, unfortunately. And then, yeah, here it is. Okay, so that's one of our shield parts. And then the last one we need is actually the key, which drops from the warden. Uh, the other spawn for it could have been, like, right in here, by the way. But if you're looking for, like, where the... Yeah, it, it's really weird. Because normally it's, like, three parts that spawn three different locations. And the essence does, in a way. Like, the essence does spawn on three different of the... I need to run back up here so I can feed this dog, I guess. But I really want power on ASAP. I mean, look, we can do it both, right? We can just backtrack and then... How hard is it going to be to feed the dog? It's going to be pretty hard to feed the dog. It's already round five? What? I feel like I've done nothing, man. Dude, there's so much I need to do. And we're already on round five? Oh, it's a nightmare. It's an actual nightmare. Um, We have to feed the three dogs. We have to... Oh, my goodness. gracious! It's okay. It's okay. Where am I going? I got to get back to that dog. I got to feed the dog. Then we got to go get power turn on. Handle El Brute, um, which I'm probably going to end up whipping out the old specialist weapon for to take him down. But we gotta, we gotta, we gotta get the dog fed. And I know there's a dog at spawn, but I wanted to get to this part of the map as early as possible. I actually think the dog at spawn is probably the easiest one because you can train there pretty easily. This one's definitely the hardest one. You can train at the docks, um, although it's not as easy I think as training in the one at spawn. But I'm a little bit sketched out being here. But hopefully, hopefully, hopefully it's okay. I assume the dog is still. There's one that just dropped. Oh my goodness gracious. This is going to probably end up resulting in me needing to pull out the, the old Wraith Fires or something here. Because we are in a bit of a predicament. Now I will take the insta-kill. It will help a bit. The thing is I can't really like hold the zombies to make sure he's able to feed. I just have to kill them otherwise I die. Alright, you ready to eat? This should be number four. If I had to guess, that's number four. So we should only need two more. If I could try to do this as best as I can. Uh, they're all going to die to like one bullet. There we go. Dude, I, where are they appearing from? Are they falling from right here? I think they are. Oh my gosh, I just keep taking slaps. That's the thing, man. Black Ops 4 Zombies, they, they, they like to get their slaps in. They like to let you know, hey, we're here. <laughs> they, they like to be heard. I don't blame them. I don't blame them. It's, it's good to be heard. But they could just be heard a little bit quieter, maybe. All right, there we go. Dog is fed. Easy peasy. Let's go. Yeah, we'll go back down. Let's get that power on. We'll kill good old Brutus. I look, we can use the... I, I don't have any issue. I look, no. I'm not caving in to my own doubts. We're using the, the sword. I have no problem with the sword. I never get it. I don't get to play Black Ops 4 that much. So we're using the sword. We're using the equipment. It's fun. It's a good time. We're going to be killing plenty of shotguns with... Or zombies with shotguns. Don't you worry. And my strategy is... um. There's another shotgun. Before we buy Mule Kick, we're going to swap out the Mog 12 for the Blundergat. That way, the Blundergat's not our Mule Kick weapon. That's my strategy. And then we'll just have a random shotgun as our Mule Kick weapon. We'll have three shotguns. Uh, I did make sure I equipped that. That way, we could have as many shotguns as possible just because I think it'll be fun. And then we got to get this turned on. It is pitch black. Literally pitch black. Okay. Brutus, my boy, come here. I got a sword for you. Watcha. Oh, he didn't work. There we go. All right. Come on. Come on, come on, go down, go down, go down, go down. Come on, I feel like I'm playing Path of Exile. <laughs> come on, come on, Hillock. We, <laughs> I'll get you with my <laughs> basic melee attack. Come on, come on, where's my mana pot? <laughs> I feel like three of you guys got that reference, man. <laughs> three of you, Max. All right, all right, that was fun. We got our Warden's Key. We need to build the shield now. Where do I want to build the shield? We'll go ahead and open up this down here so we can start reading the doctor. I want to build the shield down here. I don't really want to. I kind of want to build the shield in the cafeteria, but we don't have the cafeteria open. 
But I really, really don't want to build the shield down here. I'm fine with taking another round for the shield. We're, I'm not in any big... Dog? Dog's not here. I'm so stupid. Dog is in the other part of the map. Okay, that's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm just, I'm just a little stupid. Don't worry about me. Uh, by the way, one of the things we need is right there. One of the skulls. Yeah, man. What a fun map. I love this. Oh, I love this map so much. Don't have a sniper and look there. Ooh, spooky scary. All right. I also don't know where the perk locations are, but I guess it's not that big of a deal. We're not like in dire need of perks. That's something I like about Black Ops 4. You can kind of push off perks to be able to get the map open and everything. So okay, so Mule Kick, Mule Kick's red because it's in the uh, it's in the slot. Man, that's so weird. <laughs> red Mule Kick. Never in my days did I think I'd see it. Can we take the gondola back? I'll take the gondola back. All right, we can we can hold for a second. A quick little reminder to like, comment, and subscribe. I know I said it at the beginning, but it does mean the world to me. I do read each and every single comment. So if you could take this time and leave a comment, I really do appreciate it. Uh, they they make my day. It's it's my it's genuinely my favorite part about being a content creator. I love it. I, I love being able to interact with you guys. All right, we'll just wait for these lights to turn green, uh, and then what's my plan? We'll build the shield. We'll start focusing on getting pack a punch open. Although no no no, the pack a punch can come later. Pack a punch is easy. Pack a punch is free once there's a dog around, basically, because dogs would just give you the the, uh, the show charge that you need. So we will focus on getting the Hell's Retriever, which we need to open up through the Warden's Office, or we can head back to spawn. Let's do the Warden's Office one. We'll go through, I think it's literally to get to the new grounds. I mean, you can see it right there. It is just directly through the Warden's Office. Uh, but I need to get to the cafeteria as well. Hmm, ha ha ha. Well, three, 400 points, I suppose. Uh, yeah, we'll go to the cafeteria. That way we can get, bum bum bum, what's where I'm looking at for? The shield, we need the shield. So we'll just come through here, open up this, should be easy peasy. Nice little minus 1,000 points. I assume it's still, ah, okay. Yeah, that's, that's gonna be interesting to deal with. All right, all right, all right. Let's see, I don't know where the buildables are. I was hoping there'd be one in this general area, but to be fair, I don't even know where I'll be training. Um, hmm, curious, curious, curious. Maybe I should have just, is there still one up here? If there's one up here, it's not the worst in the world to go to, but I don't love it. But at this point, I guess it's just kind of make do with what you get. Yeah, we'll build it here, I suppose. I don't know, I bet there's one like in the, the new part of the map. I say new, like it's new to the map, but the map itself is not new anymore. Uh, there's probably one either in the warden's office or in the ward. It's definitely in the top floor of the warden's home, isn't it? I just feel like it's there, you know. I, I just get the vibe. What's in here? What are you? I don't know who you are. <laughs> I have no clue what you are. That's okay. Oh my god, well, Brutus. Jeez Louise, man. Don't scare a man like that. Don't scare a man. Alright, come on, big guy. I gotta take you down. Oh my goodness gracious, that is so many zombies. He's gonna just be disabled. Does he disable the trap? I can't remember. Is he gonna disable it? No, he won't. Does the trap kill Brutus then? Or I bet you if it's turned on, then he just like attacks it. Ooh, shit. Specialist charge. We could we could we could we could melee through some zombies, upgrade our specialist. Why not? Let's have a little bit of fun with it. We'll just use it just for a second. Just just to get back to where we need to go. Easy peasy. <laughs> it's so OP. I think the sword's the most OP one, but I'm not sure I've ever used the sword in a video. So I thought it'd be a little bit fun. Yeah, I don't know where I'm going to end up training. Probably spawn will be where I end up training once I get everything set up. But we still got a lot of setup to do. All right, dog. Begin feasting. We have things that need to be gotten done. Uh, and then once we actually get all three dogs fed and we're able to get the hmm, Monka S. And we're able to get the Hell's Retriever, we can start getting the skulls for the free Blundergat. Now, I'm pretty sure to get the skulls, we have mostly everywhere open. Um, there's one at the docks, there's the one at spawn, there's the one on the roof, which we don't have open. Uh, hold up, I have a list here. Uh, spawn, docks, door, roof, warden's office. Okay, shouldn't be too hard. I think we've got most of that open. Well, it shouldn't be too hard. Plus, you can uh, actually just like use the shield, I think, and look through it to be able to see where the skulls are. I don't plan to do that because I just know where they are from the guides I've watched. And I think two of them are in the same spot. Well, not only the one is in the same spot from Blood of the Dead, because the other one that was on the roof is on the different side of the roof. So you can't quite end up doing that. I just had the biggest fear, like, oh, I'm not recording. But I, I am. I can see I am. But it's the weirdest fear right there. That's such a <laughs> such a bizarre feeling. I've had that happen before, man. It's tragic. Whenever like I get a 40-minute video recorded and I look and it just wasn't recording. Oh, my gosh. My heart just snapped in the pieces 
All right, doggo, you done yet? Hey, all right, I'm gonna look through here and make sure there's nothing I'm missing. I'm pretty sure this area, that part of the map's pretty dead end. But I just want to do a quick little run through, make sure I'm not forgetting anything obvious. So it takes us to showers. Surely there's a buildable craft up here, right? No, there's not even any rooms up here. It's just a dead end. Okay, cool, cool, Treyarch, very cool. Yeah, I guess there's nothing else over here. Do I want to TP to showers? If I go to showers, that puts me near cafeteria, and then cafeteria I can go to new grounds. Uh, it's new grounds. <laughs> that's that's like the old uh, like internet website. <laughs> old internet website might not be the best way to describe it. It's like a, one of the original like a 2000. Oh, what a waste. What a waste of points. I just was like, oh, this will be a few hundred. Let me let me open it. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It's new grounds is uh, it's just like the I don't know origins of internet culture, right? It's like where a lot of er, early internet culture developed or something. We need to go to the new new block, new. I don't know what it's called, man. It's it's this direction. <laughs> what we need to do is go this direction. How do I pull up my shield? Is it uh, what is it called? New Industries Building. I also am not quite sure what key my shield is bound to, which would be mighty interesting because I do need to charge it. Q is specialist. E. Are you? I could have built the shield here, I suppose. E is my grenade. Hey, box, looky there. We can hit that for our last shotgun. Although I feel like our last shotgun's probably on the wall, right? Black Ops Black Ops 4 only has like three base shotguns. It's not that many, but it's still fun. It's still fun. I do think one of them, I think it's this one, becomes a rocket launcher when upgraded, which is so like boring. So maybe I maybe this one I don't want to use. I just don't ever want to use it if everyone becomes a rocket launcher. We'll try maybe we'll do our the blunder gat as our first pack a punch. That way we just don't have to that way if we get the rocket launcher one, we can just not use it and we'll swap it out. Cause I really don't want to use that. <laughs> it's, it's like it's not a shotgun, man. It's not not the fun of it. Anyways. Uh, what was I saying? Something about before I got it was like, oh, what button is my shield? I don't know. There's also a police siren outside. Maybe they're coming for me. Oh no, Monka S, Monka W. Let's see, let's see. If I can get this dog fed, dude, this shotgun is just like not putting them in the ground. Okay, so it's not three, four, five, or six. We know that's not one or two. Could it be R? No, R's reload. C, C is that. V, V's melee apparently. X, X, X is the button. Okay, and again, we're not draining essence yet just because there's no big need to until the dog round. The dog round's just the easiest way to do it. Um, I could go ahead and do it, but there's no, it, we'll, 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 all things in time, all things in time, my friends. I do think this round we can actually get the blunder guy though, which will be very fun. Uh, I don't think we will have enough points to pack a punch it, but that's fine, it's fine. All right, I want to take the teleport back. Can we Can we do that? Is that a thing we can do? Yeah, all right, all right, all right. We're making progress. So now, oh wait, no, this is where I need to get the... No, it's Showers and Wardens. I, I have it wrote down because I didn't know which teleport it was. Showers and Wardens is the one where I get to grab the Hell's Retriever because it's not in the spot it was in the original game. So we need to go down to the showers. Take a take a nice little shower, Dempsey. You smell bad, I suppose. That's what, hey, that's what the people are saying. Don't Don't shoot the messenger, please. Are you a shotgun? You're, of course you're not a shotgun. I can see it from a mile away. I don't know why. I, I was walking up to it just because I was curious, but there was... Ah. I was like, where is the door? The door is no longer here. Although, it did say the teleport was in showers. Are you the teleport right here? Yeah. Yes, sir. All right. And then we should be able to grab the Hell's Retriever. There it is. You see it? Look at it. And pick it up. Beautiful. We have this. Now, this is going to put us at the warden's office area. Which one do I need to get? I think the only one over here that I can get is the one right up on the light pole, which is right here. And skull? That's not a skull. You did not bring me a skull. I thought it was this one, right? Maybe it's the angle I was looking at it from. Maybe I was looking at it from the wrong angle. I don't know. Here, hold up. Let's see if we can get this a little bit better. If I can have a second to breathe game. Right there. No, no skull. No, <laughs> my game is lagging. Why is my game lagging so much? There's supposed to be a skull there. Maybe I should reveal them. I don't know. I guess we can suck some life out of some zombies just to reveal it and make sure I'm not like going crazy. How do I, how do I do, how do I, there we go. I was like, how do I do the suckage? I, I actually have no clue. All right, come on. How long is this going to take? Not too long. Surely it doesn't take like five years. The dogs are so much faster, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> That was like what I first saw in the guides was like, oh, you use the dogs. Is that all my zombies? And I still don't have it charged. Maybe I have it charged. I don't know. No, I think I have it charged. I don't, I don't play this map, man, if you can't tell. But it's fun. It's a fun map. All right. Yeah, it's there. Why? Okay. 
Did I have it fully charged? Like, hello? There we go. Finally. I don't know what was up with that. That's that's confusing, but we'll save our spirit blast. That way we can do pack a punch. I must have already had it charged. I have no clue. All right. So we need to go to the docks. Let's go to the docks. We'll run down through here. I don't think there's any, we have any great need to take the gondola. And then while we're going down, we can do... I'm sorry. I'm trying to look at my notes here. It's always a struggle whenever I don't have them all memorized. Um, the spawn one we can do on our way back up. We can take the gondola, right? So we take the gondola back after we get the docks one. Then it's the one at our spawn, the one on the roof. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll end. I should have ended with the, the one in the uh, in the warden's office because that's where it spawns, all right? But it's fine. We'll end with the one on the roof, I suppose. We'll make our way to the docks and then back to, no, no, no. We'll do normal spawn last. So we'll do docks, then roof, then our spawn, then mob of the dead spawn. Jeez Louise. Okay. Docks, roof, spawn, spawn. Docks, roof, spawn, spawn. <laughs> Man, I am struggling with keeping this straight. It's okay. It's okay. It's a fun time. We have a good time here over here. <laughs> it's so weird. I I think at the beginning, like, I just associate with, like, oh, the channel name is Apothos. Like, over here. But I can't say over here at Apothos because I've also turned it into, like, I am Apothos, right? So it's weird. Over here at the uh, Apothos, <laughs> I don't know. All of my fellow Apothicans, <laughs> I don't know. Over here we have fun. We have a nice time. I always wonder, like, <laughs> for videos that... Because, like, this one's the one I don't expect, like, a lot of viewers to come to. Right? This is just, like, a fun little uh, fun little one for the people who like watching the consistent uploads, not the big challenges and everything. So I just wonder if someone's <laughs> watching for the first time, and they're like, dude, what the what is this guy talking about? This guy has to be the most annoying content creator on the world. He has no thoughts straight, nothing. It's a little funny to me every time. Because I, I think it takes a little bit of warming up to get used to. I do hate this lag. My OBS is dying in the corner. I hope that the video does if the video is as choppy as the OBS is, we are in trouble, boys. That is all I know to say. But it says 60 out of 60 FPS in the corner, so we'll see. We'll see how she goes. Dude, they spawn in front of you so quickly this time around. Uh, okay, what was it? Roof. Docks, roof, spawn, spawn. Docks, roof, spawn, spawn. Okay, I need to get to the roof, which to get to the roof, I've already gone the wrong way, but we can go this way. I was going to go up the other way, it's fine. This should be, oh, we need 500 points to be able to teleport though, right? I'm not going back through the catwalk. You got me all kinds of messed up. Now, hold up. How do I, do I have to put, buy another door to get to the roof? Because like, obviously in the original, we'll grab this just because we can. Uh, obviously in the original, also perk where the dead shot is. No, we can just get up here. All right, very dope. I wrote down, it was on the corner of a box, which I assume is this box right here. Hey, all right, there we go. And then we need two more. No, three more. No, two more. Spawn, spawn. So we need to go back to our spawn, then back to Mob of the Dead spawn. To do that, we need 500 points. So I, I can start killing zombies again. We are a little low on ammo. Hey, I take it back. I take it all back. We're fine. We are living our best lives right now. Um, and I do love how optional perks are. Like, the fact that I haven't felt forced to buy a perk and I would, like, do what I want. Like, obviously, I would be stronger if I bought perks. But I'm happy that I can like push it off and try to get what I want done. Oh, is that a shotgun in the corner? That might have been. Nope, that's like an ICR, isn't it? Looks like an ICR. It's an ICR. Of course, it's an ICR. ICR, Black Ops 3 and Black Ops 4, they love them. Does the Cold War have an ICR variant? I Probably not, right? The ICR is like supposed to be futuristic. Now, does it have the the gun model for the probably like an ACR? What is the ICR based off the ACR? I'd have to imagine, right? Does it have an ACR version? Probably. I mean, that's how the games work, right? It's like, oh, we need our <laughs> we need our PP gun, which is like the LMG SMG, basically. We need our... Uh, <laughs> like, I, I never realized that like the... I'm pretty sure it like, goes PPSH, then P90 then PP Bison, then PDW, like, and, and that's like the same gun in different COD games, obviously they still have like, different damage and everything, but they're all like, modeled around the same general, like, gun family, I guess you'd call them, manufacturer, I don't know, I'm pretty sure, obviously some of them are real life guns, right, like the PPSH was a gun that existed in real life, the, the Bison might, I mean, that was in, the Bison was in Modern Warfare games. Surely they didn't make any guns up, right? Dude, did you see? Oh my gosh, it was crazy. Did you guys know that, like, gun companies pay Call of Duty to, like, put their guns in? So, like, there was a whole thing where Remington was, like, paying COD. Also, one of them should be right here. There we go. Uh, Remington was paying Call of Duty to, like, put their guns in the game so that the youth would be um, more likely to buy their gun. It's crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. Obviously, like, 
there should I'm not saying guns are bad or anything. I'm just saying like you shouldn't be marketing guns to 13 year olds, right? Like that's probably not a great thing. Like, we don't advertise cigarettes to 13 year olds unless you're Joel advertising like the nicotine and everything. I don't know. I <laughs> I don't know. It's just crazy stuff to me. I feel like there should be a little bit more, like, regulation in the area. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, look, you know, here, no, I'll take it back. I'll take it all back. Let's start putting Marlboro ads in Call of Duty. I think that's what we need. I, th I think that Marlboro, Camel, I'm sure there's other cigarette brands as well. Those, those were my parents' favorites, particularly. My dad would smoke uh, Marble, Marlboros. My mom would smoke Camels. I do not smoke. I'm, I'm not a fan of cigarettes. They did it. <laughs> By them smoking, it did a good job making me not want to smoke. <laughs> but let's make our way back, and we'll get the um, the last skull over here. It should be in the toilet. I have toilet row down. It should be in a dark toilet. Yeah, dark toilet. There we go. All right, that's the last one. Let's make our way over to the warden's office office if I can do it without dying. Oh, nice. Last zombie. So, what what could, what could happen here? Dog round could happen. Brutus could spawn, but we're going to have the blunder guy, so I'm not too scared about it. Part of me wants to keep the Mach 12 just because I know for a fact that it's not the rocket launcher one. So I think we'll do that. We'll swap out the trebuchet because we can just buy it off the wall, right? For the blunder guy. We have the blunder guy now. I wish... Now we need to start getting all of our perks in Pack-A-Punch because this thing <laughs> obviously does a lot of damage. It can shoot one time. So that's what we're working with. So we need to save up 5,000 points. We'll train in the cafeteria, I suppose. But we'll save up 5,000... It looks... The base blunder guy, maybe it's just because I've seen the upgraded one so much. The, play, the This base blunder guy looks really lame. It also looks like low res my graphics are literally on max which is why i'm lagging i should have turned them down a bit but here we are we're living with it we're vibing with it we rock on brothers <laughs> dude i i went to a um ah, it doesn't matter anyways <laughs> i <laughs> i want to tell the story but i want to do it without making um without making anyone look stupid <laughs> basically i my <laughs> how, do I, how does a man even word this it's like you know like rock on the um <laughs> the like where you do like the the fingers right i i like i don't know if it has any origins in like different culture and different meanings i just know it is rock on but there was a person giving a presentation at my school once upon a time uh, and they made it very clear that that was a satanic symbol. And I remember my friends and I would all do it then just to mess with people and mess with the teachers. Because we were little a-holes, right? It was like middle school, man. We were in like 6th or 7th grade. And we just wanted to be <laughs> mean, I guess. So, like, I don't know. It was weird. But I don't want to be... Because maybe it is. I don't know anything. It was just a funny story. I don't want to make it... Like, if you believe that, I'm not saying you're stupid. I'm just saying I was, I was a little jerk. You know what I mean? Oh, man. Uh, let's pull out the shield and we'll give it a little spirit blast. Something like that. Pack a punch will come. Where'd my ghost at? Hey, there's me boyos. Imagine these are, you know, maybe it is. Maybe it is Al and whoever. I don't know. Uh, yeah, we can pack a punch. Let's pack a punch. Let's get this sucker going. Uh, oh my god, Brutus. You are not who I expected to be here at this second. I did not know you would spawn. We have the sweeper. Two bullets now. Let's go. Oh, that is a powerful gun. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Okay. All right. I'm liking it. Hey. Hey. All right. I'm here for it. I'm here for it. Where are the other Pack-a-Punch spawns? If I had to guess, one's at Docks, one's at New Wardens, right? Now, I don't think there's any, like, indication here of where they are, but it's okay. Why is this so blue? <laughs> it's not normally that blue. <laughs> it's really blue, man. <laughs> like, you know, I don't know if you guys see that. That's really... Oh, my God. Dogs, please. Oh, why? Hey, hey, hey. I thought we had a two limit here, game. Uh, look, I know there were only two there, but I... I'm pretty sure there were three at one point. You might have had to despawn one because you realize you you goofied it. By the way, you might be wondering, because uh, I did mention in the beginning, do I want to buy this Bandler Bandit? Kind of. I mean, it gives me ammo, right? Uh, well, like, why I'm running quicker by despite quicker by being in the game. I find the ability to regen health faster uh, just very useful. Obviously, we have Mule Kick because we want the third gun just for more shotguns. Bandler Ranch just to help us with ammo and then stamina up. That way we can just run very, very quickly. That's my logic for all of them. Uh, in this game, I think they each have their own base values. Cold War is the one that changed it to our first perk that you buy. Uh, you have, it costs less, and then so on and so forth. We're not going to grab that right this second. Dude, dogs are, it's round 11 game. It's, ra oh my god, Brutus, we just, 
Oh, it didn't one shot him that time. What a shock. Now, if I, I can press my three key if I get in a spicy situation. I need to remember that. I don't, th these are much less OP than Gobble Gums, so I don't mind using them nearly as much. Uh, but we also want to get all of our perks because you might be thinking, oh, if it's such a slow gun, why aren't you running uh, Speed Cola? Well, in this game, there is no Speed Cola. There's no normal Quick Revive in the way that we think of it. There's no Double Tap. There's no Speed Cola in the way that we think of it. And there's no Juggernaut because you start with 200 health. Uh, speed Cola is given to you once you have all four of your perks. P Cap, please, you cannot, you cannot be up here. You're going to mess up my mic. I, I, I will be right back. Sorry about that, the cat jumped up on the desk, which normally would be fine, except for the fact that my microphone cable has been like giga wonky lately and not wanting to work with me. So if I end up letting him on here, it could very well just unplug my mic, which would make my greatest fears come alive, it feels like, in terms of like starting a video and then it just like having to stop because, or like starting a video and not ending up being able to get it out, basically. All right, let's grab Bandler Bandit. Um, we'll make our way to the docks, I suppose, where Mule Kick is. I don't know where Stamina Up is actually. Uh, is Stamina Up? Stamina Up's probably. I don't know. If I had to guess, Stamina Up would be in the new area, right? The Warden's home area. Because we have one at docks, we have one at spawn, but there's not one all the way over here. And I would like to go ahead and get Stamina Up, even though it's our tonic. We won't get the tonic benefit out of it yet, but it will just help us be able to move around a little bit faster. <laughs> you know, apparently... Oh, wait, no, it's right here. Easy peasy. How much are you? 2,500. I'll take it. But, like, in League of Legends... I know, in League of Legends. Uh, a lot of Korean players now are, like, uh, basically prioritizing move speed over stats because they have very low ping in Korea, right? It's not a particularly, like, um, large in terms of landmass country. So they prioritize move speed uh, because their ping is so good and their... Like, like, logic is, well, if I just dodge the enemy's stuff, then I won't need the stats, right? I can kill them if they can't kill me. If I can just, if I have the skill to just be able to dodge everything, I only need defensive stats or whatever. Um, dude, look how many there are. Why are you all waiting for me right there? Oh, I, I meant to throw out my Hellfire Grenade, but I guess we don't have those anymore. It did just get replaced with the, the Hell's Retriever, the Tomahawk, but... Anyways, uh, what was I saying? What was I saying? There was something. I was making a point about something. In oh, yeah, move speed. It's like, that's what I think about stamina up now. It's like, I have the skill. If I just move faster, I'll be fine. I'll be fine, surely. Uh, we'll head down to the docks. I guess I can take the gondola. We've not been taking the gondola too much. I was just at spawn, wasn't I? No, I got taken a showers from the warden's office. I'm not very familiar yet with all the swapping back and forth of everything the teleports and everything. this is really only like my fourth or fifth time playing this map and I played a lot of blood of the dead which is why I'm not completely blundering everything um, but like the <laughs> the skull locations I was getting so insanely mixed up on those we're doing good though we're doing good we're making I can't say decent time dude OBS is chugging oh I've got to turn down the graphic settings before the next time I play I should have known better how much is mule kick gonna be if I had to guess 4k yeah 4k who could have guessed that mule kick the perk that the most expensive perk in the game is once again well I think actually death's wish would be more expensive which I didn't end up taking. I probably should have ended up taking just because it's a very, very good perk. But we'll just make sure we're playing our best, playing our best game. We'll use um the three key if we feel like we're going to go down. If I go down and I don't press the three key, it is my own fault. There is no reason why I shouldn't press it. Or like even Q, I think, would get them off of me. I have so many outs. If I don't press one, it's it's fully on me. I, I haven't been using my other guns that much, but let's be honest, man. The sweeper is so much fun to use. Like this thing is just, mm, mwah, chef's kiss. So much better than the black ops 2 version <laughs> like the black ops 2 acid gat oh it's insanely op right but the sweeper in that game ooh, it's, a, it's a little bit rough it doesn't feel all too great to use but this this is magnificent can i please have my zombies game oh zombies where are we come on come on hut one hut two where you be like <laughs> we just see a zombie slowly crawling that'd be funny I wish the light pole uh, was still a skull. It's like such a minor thing that doesn't bug me that much, but it's always my favorite one is like trying to come over here and then like trying to do the jump to, I don't even think you have to jump, but you can just get it right there. And I always felt like so cool whenever I did it, man. I feel, I felt so awesome and cool. <laughs> I don't know, man. Whenever I do cool things in games, it makes me feel cool in real life. <laughs> like, I, I don't know. I, I like to take my, I like to immerse myself, I suppose would be the word. 
I'm totally gonna take it down over here, huh? This is really stupid of me. I think it's fine because the zombie's surely right here. Yeah, looky there. Okay, game, please. We buy this after we reload. Reload, buy the perk. Oh, we can still shoot. All right, dope. It's a decently quick reload. I could also open this door if I really need to, but I want to take the gondola back up. The issue is not like the damage, so let's swap to the mog that this way we have just a little bit more bullets. Again, I could just press E and everything. I don't know why I'm not. It's like, it's like, it's pride. It's pride. It's ego. It's like, it's a shotgun's only challenge. I'm still thinking about using the strife at the beginning <laughs> because it's like, it's not a shotgun. <laughs> like, I, it's just so ingrained in my head at this point. Okay. Uh huh. This is <laughs> a time to use our sword. We we will we will whip out the sword there and we will not be apologetic for it. I need to get back to spawn so we can get our last perk. That'll give us the quick revive. Now can we double pack the sweeper? That's something I want to test after we get our quick revive. That'll be fun to see. And then we can start working on the Mog 12, rebuy the I'm pretty sure though it turns into the rocket launcher. I need to find the other one. I should have been looking around the map. I should have been looking around the map to see if it's on the map or if I need if I'm gonna need a spam hit the box. By the way, this challenge will be going until round 20. We're gonna do we're gonna keep going until round 20. Black Ops 2 or Black Ops 4 actually is a decently difficult little challenge to get to round 40. I mean, round 40, round 20, because it, well, it's not too bad in the Aether maps, but like so many of the maps just have really really annoying things that spawn. Like nine, dude. Oh my gosh, it gets so annoying. Just like having the big guys spawn all the time, and then you start having like the toxic dudes. I thought the Aether maps had the elemental zombies on them, but I guess not. I'm probably just mixing it up with Alpha Omega because the freaking creepy crawlies are so annoying on that map. But I think the only weird things you have on this are Hellhounds and Brutus, which are honestly not that bad. It's like the least annoying map you have to deal with. It's pretty fun. It's a it's a fun map. I really enjoy it. I don't I didn't take Quick Revive, I took Dying Wish! Oh my gosh, I'm so stupid. I saw blue. I'm gonna get so many comments about oh, you did take I thought it was Gorilla. Literally, whenever I was like in my perk selector, I swapped out um I swapped out what was it? I swapped out Deadshot for because I normally love Deadshot, but I was like, I don't need Deadshot for shotguns. I swapped out Deadshot for Mule Kick and I saw blue and I was like, quick revive. Yeah, I definitely wanna I'm gonna be close to them. Whenever I get hit, I wanna be able to revive uh or not revive, but like kill myself faster. Oh, I'm so stupid. It's <laughs> I do have dying wish. I I saw blue, man. I saw blue. I thought it was quick revive. I would prefer to have quick revive. I don't mind having dying wish, but it's like minus 4k right there. I don't need dying wish. So I'm never gonna go down. Like, come on, game. <laughs> Use your brain. <laughs> I just it's such a useless investment of points because I won't go down. I am I am him. I am better. I <laughs> I am priming myself for failure. Man, man, oh man. Do you guys ever, whenever you say a word, just like get a flashback? I, whenever I said prime, I got a flashback to like, I had this golf cart when uh, it was a golf cart, it was a go kart. I had a go kart whenever I was young. And to start it, you had to like pull um, the, the engine string, right? But before you did that, you had to like push down on this little like squishy thing <laughs> and it primed the engine. It primed the engine. I don't know what the squishy thing is called, but it, it got, I assume it gets oil or maybe it like, get something with gasoline I actually don't know how the priming mechanism works that'd be a question for my <laughs> for my family but I just remember like I whenever I said the word priming it I immediately just thought about me pushing on the squishy thing and like the liquid would go up in it but you couldn't prime it too much or else it would uh it would do something <laughs> I don't remember man good memories though good memories I always love looking back on the fallen memories all right let's grab dying wish and then we'll need to get back to pack a punch. We'll get back. Also, this should increase our reload speed now. Our we should be reloading faster, which we are. But then we also, yeah, look how much quicker we run. I, I'm pretty sure you only get the faster reload. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's faster than it was. Yeah, it definitely is. So yeah, we get our faster reload. We run giga fast now. Oh, it's so nice, so nice, so beautiful, so pretty. But now I want to actually take a quick look around here. Let me make sure there's not a pack a punch spawn here before I go wandering around because I feel like there probably is or something or another that'd be my luck is there I feel like you yeah no one escapes live you are a pack a punch spawn okay so it's either on the roof and there's no indication I'm pretty sure because I looked above it while it was on the roof and I didn't see any indicator for where it could be I don't think it's like the gobble gum where the lightning will strike it so it's either on the roof or it is on or I assume near the warden's house because you have this side of the map the middle of the map and then the far side because that's how Treyarch do that's how Treyarch do be doing it. I I like that 
Treyarch has such a definitive way of like placing things that without knowing where the things are, I can pretty easily guess like the general area because you just split it into thirds, right? I don't know. I actually, I really enjoy whenever the game design is like so clear that you can kind of interpret that. Also, we're only around 15 at 40 minutes in, but to be fair, the next few rounds, once we figure out if we can double pack a bunch of things, oh, I need to rebuy the Essex. Mm, I actually don't remember where I bought it though. I think it was maybe, no, it wasn't in cafeteria, not cafeteria. I think maybe it was, I don't know. I thought it was down below. Yeah, 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 it's right by the citadel, the cat catacombs. The, the spirally staircase as we will now be referring to it as. All right, where is me no one's escape alive? No one escapes alive. Hello, does anyone escape alive? I need someone to tell me no one escapes alive. Game, pretty please. This is a problem. This is a big problem. I hear Brutus or a dog. I don't know which. Hello, dog. All right, so I didn't immediately see a no one escapes alive. Maybe there's only two spawns, but that'd feel weird. It's Treyarch. They do things in three. Come on. Use your noggin. I probably did all that talking. Okay. <laughs> That was a little bit spaghetti. All that talking about how I could probably infer where it would be. No way out. That's not no one escapes alive, though. Hmm. Where, where? No, I didn't, it could still be on the roof, right? Like, it, there's definitely a chance. All right, let's stop using this. Where? The last... It's Surely it's not in the catwalk, right? That'd be psychopathic. What is that sound? Bro, that's a, that's a Black Ops 2 multiplayer sound if I've ever heard one. All right. Let's, let's take a quick second here. Make sure... Who are you? Woman. <laughs> that is who you are. Um, place the sweep. Oh, no, no, I do not want to place the sweep. I won't be able to get it back. Oh, free points. Grab the free points. I meant to run up here. Where are you, Pack-a-Punch? I was, I was certain there would be one over here, man. I was certain. I feel bad. I still feel like there's one over here. Like, I feel baffled. Really, game? I am so shocked by that. Okay, fine. All right. I get it. I, I'm, I am muy stupido. That's, that's all you had to say, I suppose. No way out. Not no one escapes alive, though. Maybe it's down here? But why would it be down here? It wouldn't make... Oh, it's on the docks. It's for sure on the docks, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, instead of being far away, middle, other far away, it's spawn up and down. Which I don't... I guess, like... I don't know. Oh, Brutus, I did not expect you to be right there. <laughs> it seems like he didn't expect me either. It was a little bit of a shock for both of us. Dude, they spawned like, in front of you so much. Why? Why, game? You don't need to be... You don't need to... Citadel. Citadel. Citadel tunnels. I, I... I... Whenever I was in middle school, it was like whenever Rick and Morty first came out, like season one and two, I, I think it was like the ending... I, I don't even know if I ever saw an episode called like Citadel first, but I know it's like a thing because it was a meme dawn like, during... I think, like, I don't know, man. I don't give a that. I just know it's a thing. So every time I hear the word Citadel, my brain immediately goes to it. And it's, like, <laughs> the stupidest, like, I don't know if it's ticks. I, I don't know what you call it. But like, every time I say certain words, my brain just, like, goes to certain images of places. Dude, I swore I was able to. Sh Can I grab the double points? Oh, my gosh. I had, like, no health there. That was horrifying. Not a fan of all that. At least a uh, dying wish didn't proc. All right. Looking for a no way out. Is there a way out around here, boys? Let me see. I feel like it would be over here, but I don't... I feel like it would be right here. But I'm not seeing the signs. Uh, look, I guess the signs don't have to be there. Oh my gosh, hello, buddy. But I just feel like they would be. Do you say no way out? I can't tell. I saw the word one. Ah, no way out. So right here. So I guess it's on the roof right now. Because unless it's swapped between rounds, it could be a spawn now, I suppose. Probably. We'll end the round, and then... Oh, I guess it's not ending the round. Alright, we'll go ahead and go through the gondola, then. We gotta, we gotta pick up our pace here. I forgot to buy the dang other shotgun! Hold up, let me go grab the other shotgun right quick. I ve, I ve, I ve. I know, dude, I know it's gonna be... I know it's gonna be the explosive one. I'm not gonna be happy with it. I, I'm not. I'm not. I know it is. I know it is. I don't know it. I know it is. I doubt, I doubt myself, but I feel rather confident knowing it is. I'm <laughs> I would be very embarrassed if I'm wrong about this, but I'm just going to hope that I'm not. As every good content creator does, I will speak confidently and hope I am not wrong. I am baffled by the amount of time I've taken. Is it, are we going to reach an hour? No, we don't reach an hour. Surely we don't reach an hour. All I have to do is pack a bunch of the mog, double pack a bunch of the mog, see if the sweeper can be pack a punched again. 
and then boom bada bing right boom bada bing we're done we're good we're vibing we're chilling we're hanging around not like not like the rest of the guys are hanging around though no not like those guys we're, we're, doing, we're just hanging out we're having a good time i don't want to end the round though because if i end the round <laughs> the back of bunch could spawn down here right Watch it already spawned down here and I didn't notice. We're on our way to the roof. Yeah. I guarantee you it's like it spawned now or something with my luck. I, I, what's going to happen is I'm going to end up having to kill one of the dogs as I'm running through. It would have been like on the roof where it spawned, but now it's back at docks. I'm going to end up just running around trying to find this dang back bunch. I hope there's only three spawns. There's a there's potentially more and I just don't know. I should have just gone up through up top. I don't know why I dropped down. I hesitated and I was like... Yeah, I'll do it <laughs> with no reasoning about why I would do it. There is no conscious decision. Sorry, bud. <laughs> Looks like you're having a rough go of it. I hope you enjoyed the steamy hot shower. Maybe it'll help, you know, loosen your thoughts, relieve some of the tension that seems to be holding you up. You know what I mean? <laughs> uh, can we double pack a punch it? No, we can't. That's fine. Pack a punch of the mog. And then we need to pack a punch it four more times, right? OMG right hook. What? <laughs> That's so what like mog that's so stupid omg right hook that's so stupid right like i'm not being <laughs> it's pretty stupid right <laughs> like <laughs> i don't think i'm being too harsh on it omg right hook <laughs> like i get it's a it's a the changing the letters of mog right like i that's uh, not lost on me here imagine the box teleports with my gun in it Oh, what a nightmare. Dude, did the dogs not spawn and respawn? Are they just running at me? That's so funny. Alright. We need one more pack a bunch to finish increasing this thing's damage. Uh, uh yeah. Alright. Peace out, buddy. It was fun. Do I get to know where you're going? Like, it doesn't go... I don't know if you can see it. It didn't go very far up. So I doubt that I'll be able to tell... No. I can't tell whatsoever. I was hoping it'd be like, Ah, my foot. What was that? Oh, wait. Did I see it? Dude, my, my ankle just felt like, I don't know, that was not a great feeling. <laughs> that was so weird. My ankle, like my bone, <laughs> ooch, ow, my bone hurting juice. Why did I drink the bone hurting juice? <laughs> oh man, oh, I, dude, my brain is fried today. Like I literally starting, like I so many times tried doing this like at the beginning and within two minutes each time I had to reset because I just like either like just screwed up what I was saying or this side or the other. And like, I don't mind messing up what I'm saying as long as it's not like in the first two minutes. If it's in the first two minutes, then I get a little like, all right, might as well restart. We're not losing too much time to not look like a complete buffoon. You know what I mean? Plus I thought it was funny to acknowledge it. Like, yeah, I've messed up a lot for a very simple challenge. All right, we'll head back down to the docks. We'll take, we'll take our little trip down. We don't have enough. Oh, they're all going to be down here waiting for me, aren't they? At least we have like 12 bullets. Kilowatt is, in Black Ops 3, very good. In this game, they're all pretty met, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure they, they made it to where none of them were particularly overpowered. That's fine. We don't mind. <laughs> Sorry about the yawn, gamers. So that means it is in... Where? Where was the other location? I know it. It's at spawn, so I need to go, man, man, oh man, oh man, so much running, don't we look, that's why, that's the reason why this is taking so long, because there's just so, uh-oh, maybe, <laughs> maybe just looking for a no way out sign is exactly the way I need to be doing this, <laughs> I guess it needs to be maybe the three signs, okay, all right, well, at least it makes it a little bit more interesting then, huh? So at this point, if it is not at spawn, I'm sorry, I'm trying to remember everything. I don't know where it is. If it's not at spawn, I don't know where it is because that one no way out sign now has me all kinds of confused because I'm pretty sure the one at spawn and the one on the roof are like four different signs arch arcing, right? But the one at the docks wasn't. The one in the tunnels wasn't. And I can guarantee you that tunnel one <laughs> is not a spawn. I should maybe be looking for like a power thing near 1750. What an expensive door. Uh, maybe I should be looking. Okay, it's here. Maybe there's a power switch here like there is at the one on the roof. Nope, there's not. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Thanks, game. 
I don't know, it doesn't matter. We'll get this sucker fully pack a punch. I'm not too stressed about the the Essex or the other one, because I don't want to spend like forever hitting the box. I'm pretty proud of what we've done. I enjoyed using the sweeper. We'll use this just for a bit. Um, it's actually pretty horrible, but it's fine. We'll keep using this. We'll get it fully pack a punch, use it a little bit more. I am potentially taking it down here. That is I do, I'm just not able to get through them. You see what I mean? Like, I'm spinning, a, like, so many bullets on a horde, and I'm not even... The bullet pin feels really bad, for one. Again, I don't think it would be as bad if we had, like, the attachments and everything on it. But with no attachments, it feels pretty brutal. Let's get the sucker fully, fully pack-a-punch. Uh, and if you don't know the Black Ops 4 pack-a-punch system works, is you have to pack-a-punch it four times. So you get, like, a 50% damage boost each time you pack-a-punch it or something like that. But then they said boost damage. But now if we go to it, it just costs 1,500. So 2,500, and it doesn't say to boost damage anymore. We have Brain Rot, which I think is the best one in Black Ops 4. I'm pretty sure. I think if you know it's Cold War where if you upgrade it, it can like con take control of the boss zombies, which is really cool. I do like it. It is my favorite one in Cold War. At least favorite one in Black Ops 3. Probably just because it's boring, right? But look, can be able to control a big dude. Look, whenever I play Bloons, you know I be using the Necromancer and converting the ZOMGs into BADs. You know, <laughs> you, you pick up my vibe, you smell me, fam. <laughs> dude. I am having so much fun. I hope you guys are as well. I know it's a, a long scatterbrain video, but I, I really am having just the time of my life uh, being able to being able to share the time with you guys. I, I'm, I, I'm happy I'm also able to find like, this video. I know it has been a long time coming. I know it has. Um, am I going to take it down? No, I don't think so. One more hit and I would have, but I didn't because that's skill diff, baby. I've, I'll tell you guys, I have not been taking downs in videos lately. I'm pretty proud. I've been doing pretty dang good about not taking downs in videos. Like, I, I, that's all I'm saying. I I am reclaiming my claim to Zombies fame, which is my claim to Zombies fame being I'm not the worst player in the world. Because a lot of times, compared to like the videos I see other content creators put out, I am just like, I am significantly worse at this video game than you. <laughs> like, I am probably the least skilled out of all the content creators I've I think all of them are just a million and one times better than me. But you know what? I talk a lot. <laughs> but with that said, I don't see a reason to go past around 20. I feel like we've done pretty good here. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Wait, no, 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 no. Black Ops, the Black Ops 4 is the one where you have to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you survived 20 rounds. If I end it now, you survived 90. All right, all right, all right. I got, I got one more in me. I got one more in me. <laughs> one last mission. <laughs> Or I'll tell you what, though. We are going to be using this uh, this sword for this one. We're going to get a big old group together, and we're going to mow through them with the sword. That's what we're going to do. <laughs> in the shotguns, only challenge with a shotgun. No siree, no way. I'm also holding out the sweeper, because this gun's actually fun to use, unlike the version of the MOG I have. Again, I'm pretty sure once you have attachments on it, it's really fun. Let's see also what a fully charged, like, Hell's Retriever can do. Also, I'm amazed I've not taken it down yet doing this stupid train. All right, fully charged Hell's Retriever. Now, I don't have the Hell's Redeemer or whatever the Pack-a-Punch version is. Uh, oh, it's not killing, actually. Interesting. All right, I'm going to get in the middle of them, and... Oh, I can do Merciless Dash. Oh, my gosh. That was fun. Yeah, me and you both, Dempsey. Me and you both. Oh, I don't have... Oh, I'm so sorry, guys. Normally, I have the subtitles on for being able to see what the characters are saying, but I don't have it on this time. Whoopsie. Because normally, I really like having it because I like uh, what the characters say and everything. It's just fun to me. But I suppose I did forget it this time. Well, what can you do? It's how it be. It's how it goes. Uh-oh. I have... Gotten myself in a three, 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 three. Ha <laughs> ha! Yes, sir. -y. That's how we do it. Lucky there. Oh, we did have dying wish though, so I would have been fine. But I, we we actually pressed the button. We got trapped. We pressed the button. That's the quick time skill reaction. I'm the quick quick time. What's the term? There's a term here I'm looking for. Quick time event. Quick time event. I'm pretty sure that's it. Real time event. Real time event. Something like that. Anyways. I, uh, that's, that's the skill test. I am <laughs> proving myself more and more as the days go on. The time ticks, the days go on. Looky there, looky there. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. But yeah, have a good one, everybody, and take it easy.